UI Changes Welcome. Through this video, you will be introduced to the new functions added in Marvelous Designer 11. Let's have a look at the UI Changes. Marvelous Designer 11 is composed of two main tabbed windows, General and Store. You can find the two tabs at the upper left side of the screen. The General tab is for creating garments. And by selecting the Store tab, you can find various complete styles from the Marvelous Designer website. You can now easily purchase garments through this in-app store without navigating to our website through a browser. Using the previous versions of Marvelous Designer, you can open a maximum of two workspace windows at once. This new version of Marvelous Designer lets you view as many as four windows at one time by toggling the window view options at the bottom right-hand corner. You can always bring the layout back to the original settings with the reset button. Every workspace window can be changed to one of over 10 modes by clicking the drop down list at the top center of the window. At the top right hand corner of each window, you will find a duplicate icon which allows you to duplicate the window as a pop up. These pop up windows can be placed by dragging on either side of the window. The windows on both sides can also be closed, hidden, and grouped with others. And selecting the arrow on the top left hand corner allows you to hide the window. The window turns into a tab on either side of the screen after being hidden. If you click on that tab, the window appears again. Selecting the X at the top right hand corner allows you to close the window. Each pop up window can be dragged onto an existing side window to group them together. Their title will appear as tabs at the bottom of the window. You can select the tabs to view each window in a group. You can also select the mode you want to use through the drop down menu on the pop up window, which allows users to activate multiple modes via multiple windows simultaneously. If more than one 3D window is open, you can use different tools to each 3D window, and the 2D pattern window is linked to the selected 3D window, so the function you are using will automatically appear in the 2D window. For example, if you select a 3D window where the TAC tool is being used, you can also directly create or edit your TAC in the 2D pattern window as both windows are linked. In the same way, if you toggle the Select Move tool in the selected 3D window, the same tool is automatically activated in the 2D pattern window. However, only one 2D pattern window is allowed to be open at a time. This means that if you change another window to the 2D pattern mode via the drop down list, the windows will swap around. You can find every window type in the main menu as well. Click Display and mouse over Window. If you make a selection, the window will pop up. By toggling the Reset to Default Layout in the bottom right hand corner, you can always bring the layout back to the original settings. In Marvelous Designer 11, more tools are grouped together than in previous versions.
For your convenience, you can view a group of tools as a pop-up by either clicking the dashed line with scissors in the tool group or by pressing the Enter key. Any main menu containing the dash line can be duplicated as a pop-up, just like the tool groups. You can relocate the toolbar to the top, bottom, left, and right of a window by clicking the control handle on the leftmost side. You can also find the Show Hide Toolbar button at the far right of the view icons in each window. Toggle it, and the toolbar will appear or disappear. Lastly, clicking the arrow at the very bottom of the interface will open and close the Animation Editor.